Hi, I'm Peter Jones, Chartered Surveyor, Author and Property Investor, and we're going to be thinking about how to find deals in the Estate Agent's Office. Now, one of the big stumbling blocks, I think, of going to an estate agent to find deals is if you walk in and say, I'm an investor, they're probably just going to roll their eyes because they've probably had 10 people who consider themselves to be investors going in that morning and you're the 11th and quite frankly most people who go in saying that they are investors and they're looking for deals don't really know what they're talking about so I think there's certain things that we can do to prepare ourselves before we go into the estate agent's office which are going to give us a much greater chance of the estate agent taking us seriously and persuading the estate agent to try us out by sending us a few deals. First and foremost, I think, is being absolutely clear on what it is you want to buy and why you want to buy it. I know when I first started, and when I first started trawling around estate agents' offices, the big stumbling block was I wasn't entirely clear what I was looking for. I wasn't entirely sure why I was looking for a particular type of property. I wasn't particularly sure why I was looking in a particular area. So I think it sounds very obvious, but many, many people miss this point. Be absolutely clear what it is that you're looking for. Now, I've been asked before, can you go into an estate agent and ask for different types of properties for different types of strategies? Well, yes, I think you can. Would you do that on your first visit? Not necessarily, because what do we try and do when we go into the estate agent's office? Well, first and foremost, what we want to do on our very first visit is we want to start building rapport with the estate agent, but we want to be able to persuade the estate agent and by that I don't necessarily mean arguing with them, it's more about our actions, it's more about our attitude. But by our presence, if you like, we can show the estate agent that we're serious, that we mean business, that we know what we're talking about. So if I was going to go in looking for buy-to-let properties, for example, I'd want to know exactly the area of town that I want to buy my buy-to-lets in. I'd now, what, how would I ascertain that before I go to the estate agents? Well, very often it comes from talking to letting agents. And I think, again, this is perhaps a, a fundamental misunderstanding which many new and beginner investors make. They think that the best place to start is the estate agents. I'd argue that, that that is the second best place to start. Start with the letting agents. Go to all of the letting agents in your target area and start talking to them. Find out what it is that tenants actually want to rent and then you can hone it down by actually asking them, well, whereabouts is it that the tenants are actually looking to rent? So they may tell you the type of property. Start asking them where you're going to find that type of property. Then when you go to the estate agent's office, you can start talking to the estate agents in detail about the type of property that you're looking for. That is going to make a massive difference because the alternative is just to walk into the estate agent's office and say, look, I'm an investor. You're the 11th of the day. They roll their eyes. What is it you're looking for? Well, I'm just looking for something to rent out. Where? Well, I'm not sure yet. Anywhere will do at the right sort of price. I'm interested in anything. It's too vague. It's too fluffy. It doesn't mean anything. If you can go in and be very specific and say, look, I'm looking for this type of property in this area, then you're going to be taken seriously. So that would be my first top tip of how to find deals in the estate agents. By the way, if you want to find out how I started my portfolio, and if you'd like to do the same, if you'd like to copy my plan, as it were, then just go over to my website, www.propertyteacher.co.uk, click on Learning with Peter, and you can invest in yourself by purchasing a, a copy of my ebook, The Successful Property Investor's Strategy Workshop, which basically takes you through the process that I used, starting with none of my own money to buying two million pounds worth of properties over a four year period, really not knowing what I was doing, if I'm going to be perfectly honest. So I will show you everything I did right, I'll show you everything that I did wrong so that you can avoid all the mistakes I made and you can copy my plan. And by the way, do you have to stop at two million? Well, of course not, and I didn't stop there. I've carried on expanding the portfolio since as well. So head over to my website, you'll find that a great resource and it'll be very helpful. Until next time, Here's to successful property investing.